Toyota inventory update and a hurricane kills a million mile SUV, but Toyota replaces it for free. Hi, I'm Kevin Hunter, the homework guy here today with the amazing Elizabeth, the homework gal. Liz, it's awesome to be able to report on a heartwarming story like this. First, there was the million mile Tundra and now there's a million mile Highlander. Sure. A Florida road paver named Mark Miller received keys to a brand new Toyota SUV after his old one was totaled by a storm. And then at the end of today's show, we have some good news to share, which points to the ending of the Toyota drought of vehicles, which, as we've said, is simply an end to Toyota's sandbagging they've been doing. Yes. Continuing with our first story, a Florida man received a free vehicle from Toyota. Pretty nice of them. Never forget to change your oil was the free advice given by Mark Miller, a Florida resident who piloted his 2006 Toyota Highlander hybrid more than one million miles. But sadly, Miller lost his reliable ultra-high mileage SUV back in September 2022 during Hurricane Ian when his home in Bonita Springs, Florida was flooded by unprecedented storm surges related to the hurricane. Liz, you mentioned that Mark said never to forget to change your oil. From the man himself, Mark Miller gave the secret to his million miles, which beyond regular oil changes is having routine maintenance and a reliable mechanic look at it and stay on top of trouble symptoms. That's precisely the advice that we give our viewers too. Buy a good, reliable vehicle in the first place and then take excellent care of it. That's right. Having any used car purchase inspected first by a good mechanic and then combining that with regular maintenance has been the key to our great success with vehicle purchases, never once having ever needed to purchase an extended warranty. To viewers who disagree, let me ask you this. What value would an extended warranty have been worth to somebody like Mark Miller? Not much, that's for sure. So while Mark Miller lost his reliable vehicle to Hurricane Ian, luckily for him, Toyota, which has been making something of a habit of gifting folks replacement vehicles following natural disasters, and they recognize this historic vehicle event as an opportunity to come to Miller's aid with a brand new Highlander, and they did so free of charge. Miller got to the million mile marker in his original Highlander doing road paving work across the state, and they weren't super easy miles on the vehicle. Mark described his Charlotte SUV as a workhorse because he used it for all things work related, from towing trailers for his asphalt paving business to using it as a mobile office for work on the go. I've probably done about 8,000 trips across Alligator Alley in that Highlander, said Miller. I think I took it for granted at times. After 17 years, only a catastrophic flood could kill it. Wow. <laughs> The SUV was Miller's first Toyota and the first vehicle he'd ever bought brand new, and he babied it with the help of his go-to mechanic, Frank Bryce of Germain Toyota of Naples, standing left as pictured here. Back in January, Richard Germain, the owner of Germain Toyota of Naples, and Wendell Hardy, the general manager, heard of Miller's story and invited him back to the dealership that loyally sold and serviced his old car. Miller was under the impression that he was going to get another cooler like the gift that he'd received from Toyota after he had reached the 500,000 mile mark in his Highlander previously. Jermaine said to Miller, the fact that you rode your Toyota for over 16 years, put over 1 million miles on it, and allowed us to be a part of keeping that vehicle going for you, in my mind, probably makes you the most loyal customer that we've ever had. We wanted to thank you for that loyalty. Jermaine Toyota awarded the Miller family with a 2023 Highlander Hybrid Bronze Edition in cement gray to reflect his paving business, sporting a giant red bow. As you can imagine, and as he should be, Miller was very gracious. I'm going home to load up my tools, he said, but first I need to protect this. I'm going to get some seat covers. This is a magical moment. Picking up my 2006 Highlander Hybrid was magic, but this here is super magic. Speaking of a little magic happening, another piece of magic is finally going on with Toyota and their vehicle shortage. Toyota lovers have long been complaining about the lack of availability of Toyota vehicles. And as we've been saying for some time now, Toyota has been sandbagging to intentionally keep inventory low and to keep prices up. This headline proves that's exactly what's been happening. Toyota forecasts record production, sales, and profit this fiscal year. Now, how could Toyota suddenly forecast this after complaining for months that they have been held back by the pandemic? Amazing. Mm -hmm. Toyota's outlook, outlined by CEO Koji Sato, announced quarterly financial results, underscores its financial strength even as it races to play catch-up on EVs and cope with an influx of aggressive new rivals from the likes of Silicon Valley in China. So it's competition that's finally getting them into high gear. And then even more details in this article that point to the fact that Toyota was indeed sandbagging. Japanese auto titan Toyota Motor Corp will soon throw open the factory taps to deliver all-time high production output 
record global sales and best ever operating profit level. Wait, Toyota will soon throw open the factory taps, clearly indicating the throttle has not been at full for some time, but now they will. Very interesting. Yeah, exactly. The forecast Toyota declared puts one of the world's biggest automakers on the path to brisk expansion after what they say was a year in which production plans were dented by lingering pandemic woes and semiconductor shortages. We just don't buy that explanation. Not very much. Mm -mm. It goes on to say that ramping up supply should help alleviate tight inventories in key markets such as the U.S., so that's good news for our viewers out there, and create a robust profit structure to fund Toyota's future investment in electric vehicles. So finally, coming soon, some vehicle inventory relief for Toyota lovers as the company finally publicly announces they are ramping up production to full speed ahead. Mm -hmm. Watch for more Toyotas to start reaching dealer lots soon. I'm going to wrap up today's show by continuing our solicitation to good dealers to reach out and contact us. In fact, we've created a sign-up document for dealers to go to to enter their information. You see the sign-up form scrolling on the back screen here, and we'll share the link to the document for dealers in the description box below and pin it in the comment section. We are serious about connecting with good dealers out there and subsequently connecting them with our viewing audience. If any dealers would like to have direct conversation with us, you can do so either by texting 701-441-3399 or email kevinthehomeworkguy at gmail.com. We are on a mission to spread the news about good dealers because we've made a pledge to highlight and support you good dealers out there. We most definitely want to hear from you. All right, if you're new here at the Homework Guy channel or you're a good dealer stopping in for the first time, as Liz just shared, we are on a mission to highlight and promote good dealers around the country. So we'd love to hear from you. Use the dealer document we have posted in the description box below or pinned in the comment section and we will be in touch with you. We want to add you to the list of good dealers we are building. In summary, we are in search of dealers who offer good customer service with no funny business and provide a simple, honest car buying experience for the customers. So if this last sentence happens to describe your dealership, we'd love to hear from you. Again, our contact information, 701-441-3399 or email kevinthehomeworkguy at gmail.com. We look forward to hearing from you. By the way, I'd also like to thank the many viewers who have sent good dealer nominations to us, and we encourage others to do the same. Just send us plenty of details as to why you think a particular dealer is good. Use the email, kevinthehomeworkguy at gmail.com. Also, for our newest viewers out there, it's vitally important that you don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell so you don't miss out on our future announcements. Later this year is coming the announcement of an all-new car buying process to help car buyers get a new vehicle without all the typical hassles. There's a simple Google document to sign up for early notification on, and you can find it at our website, thehomeworkguy.com. Right here, courtesy of the Homework Guy team and our show, is where you'll always find the most reliable tips and helpful information to assist you with finding an enjoyable car buying experience in today's car market. We've been living up to that for 14 years. Join our fast-growing group of subscribers and become a part of our ginormous YouTube family. If you just recently joined our fast-growing group of subscribers, we welcome you. Also, thanks to our many faithful followers who just keep coming back, and to all of our longtime subscribers out there, you guys rock. God bless you all. I'm Kevin Hunter, the Homework Guy, signing off with Amazing Elizabeth, the Homework Gal. The Homework Guy team is serving truth and justice in the car business and always will. We, we gotta, gotta go. go.